Hello guys, welcome back to the episode number uh, 10 of MTASA uh, LUA scripting. In this episode, we'll talk about uh, loops and tables, how to how to manipulate tables, how to get the data from them that you stuck. So tables are defined like that, basically. Yeah, this is MPT table. We should store it inside it. If you want uh, numerical. Uh, Inside it, we can store functions, numbers, strings, anything you want. I will store. Uh, I will store here a table, also a table, another table that contain uh, maybe uh, yeah, maybe you have a company and uh, everyone have uh, its job. So yeah, we will store the name of the employees. Uh, the job or the occupation which will be uh, like uh, and the age ah uh, not employee, we, we have a yeah maybe you have a company of uh, developers <laughs> anyway so we store the name the occupation and uh, the age well So yeah, the question here, how to get those names and jobs, also age, from this table here? We should use, the, uh, also called as a nested loop, or nested for loop, to unpack um, that table here. Uh, I, which is the index, or you also you can use K, which is the key. Index value in pairs, TBL, do, and. So basically, when they execute, when this loop is executed, uh, the i first of all at the first execute will be one, which indicates the index of uh, this table here, uh, and then will be two, uh, three, and so on, until it reach the the end of uh, the table. So we need to add to chat box and the value we carry on on the value here, which is uh, the first the first at uh, the first execute it will be this table here. Second execute so uh, name. I'll try to type so fast because I don't need the episode to be so long, so it will be kind of bored, uh, kind of boring. Yeah, let me just get the box here because my keyboard is not working very well. I don't know why, anyway. And we need to open box here the, the key. One. So at this table here, the uh, the key of the data here is one. So this is one. The key is one. This is keys two. This is keys three. Contactinate again. Job. And uh, v two. Also age. Age. Yeah. Age and uh, oh, come on, V three. So if you c execute that, uh, it will output the age and uh, everything else related to your employees. So as you can see here, name John, job pixel artist, uh, Alex, job developer, and Tony, director. So this is how to execute a. Uh, to how get tables from uh, the how to get sorry data from table. Also, uh, this is not all that uh, you need to learn. Also, we can uh, use uh, string and uh, indexed like that. Uh, yeah. 
also to get them so this is the i here will not will not be one or uh, will not be one yeah it will be first so this will be related to this key here so you n if you need to get to this table here you n if you need to get yeah this table here you need uh, to to call it using your key that you define it here first which is first as you can see you can use here second third and so on uh, and the i will be changed also you can here use a key to uh, so this one here it will change to uh, name yeah so uh, if you exclude that it will give error why because this is numerical and this is string so you need to change that name also you need to change uh, here job age and so on using uh, those indexes so indexes are are kind of tricky uh, but uh, if you work on them and always try to script and using them, uh, you will uh, you will got that. So tables are useful. You may ask why? Because we can record uh, if you need, for example, to create a lot of markers. We not need to, cr to create marker, create marker, create marker. No, we need to stock x, y, and z coordination in a table. So. Uh, and then loop uh, thought out that table and then create a marker, which is a function provided by MTA. Anyway, there is another kind of table I which I will not use table inside the table. I will use uh, another variables and like 15 comma. Do not forget the comma. Wait, yeah, I need to tell you something. Do not forget a, a comma here after you're defining a value that you store here in the table. Do not forget ever ever a comma. Mm, yeah, we can store also numbers five. I will store string which is uh, high comma also uh, anything else anything that I want else what we see we can store uh, string we can, we, I can store a function here or user data but I will not try that uh, right now I will store uh, flow at ah, this is pi mat dot pi and so on so to how to get the data from this we will not use for IV pairs table do uh, expression we need to use another one I will tell you uh, so yeah we use that uh, if we have a table inside the table or table inside the table inside the table or something like that yeah I know guys it's kind of complicated but it's very important you need to uh, understand that part very very well to uh, to get in more complex things so here we need to use for i equal one. So the index will be the will be always always one in uh, tables uh, unless you change that. Uh, so yeah, by default it's one. Another programming language like Java is zero. Um, well, we don't care about those. For i equal one, and we'll use uh, here the sharp sharp expression. Uh, let me get sharp expression because it's not working for me. Hope, uh, yeah, sharp. Because uh, I cannot write that using my keyboard, it's broken. I'm going to try to replace... I have uh, another keyboard, but I will try to uh, to plug in it uh, as soon. So the sharp expression here, flowed by the table value, uh, variable, uh, name, will get uh, the length of, uh, the, length of uh, the table, which is here 1, 2, 3, and 4. With, so this is will be 4. Do end. So we need to output all of those variables. We need to output chat box. Our first value R. And to concatenate that to what? To the table itself. Float by uh, oh no, we need to copy again brackets. Sorry guys for for uh, for this. Yeah, I, I thought that I have my keyboard working so fine but it's not anyway sorry for that uh, flowed by the buckets and I we should associate it I which is uh, we should give I which is the index or the key index key is the same basically start my script and here we will uh, will output for us all those variables here to output chat uh, at the chat box also, if you change the index here, you can change it anyway, to a lot like that, index like a uh, number. If you change that, we will not use a uh, 4. Instead of that, we will use a uh, table 
index number to get that one that number here later but let's see the result yeah it's it, our value is uh, our values are high our values are high, uh, 15 high 30.14 and uh, the pi here yeah let's try this example here in, if you change that to uh, to uh, string index not a numerical index you, you need to call that string or greeting or whatever and anyway, we'll, we'll try that yeah let's keep that as it is let's try to output output chat box number save and restart and you will get uh, your number here which is 15 I think 15 mm -hmm. yeah it said 15 as you can see we used index and how to get uh, data that you stock already from uh, a table also this is very useful you need to understand that episode in order to continue with the series and to learn uh, programming also so we, need, we use tables basically to create a lot of markers uh, to store data if you want to create group system store members uh, their uh, databases also it's very important tables to uh, to carry on uh, so yeah you should uh, you should understand that very very well to continue and uh, if you don't understand that post a, a comment if you have any question uh, I will uh, answer of course uh, sorry if I'm kinda late but I will answer don't don't uh, don't worry about that anyway do like if you uh, don't do like if you understand something from this video and uh, do subscribe also if you haven't already and I gonna see you in the next uh, time have a nice week bye